So first, given that y is equal to 3, 2x plus 2 power of 3, then find dy over dx. So we see here dy over dx. So we know that this is constant. We can bring it down. Or you can directly multiply the power with constant to get 9. But I want to show you one by one here. So what will happen is that 3 will bring forward. So here 2x plus 2 and then you minus the power with 1. So 3 minus 1. Right after that, uh, you differentiate what is inside the bracket which is 2x plus 2. So here 3 times 3 is 9. So you see here you can directly multiply the power with the constant in front. So here you will get 2x plus 2 power of 2. When you differentiate 2x, you get 2. When you differentiate 2, you get 0. So you ended up with 18. 2x plus 2 square. So you can see here, this one is equal to this one. So when you differentiate 18, 2x plus 2 power of 2 dx. So you see here, this one is equal to this one. So you know when you integrate dy over dx, you will get y. So, which is equal to 3, 2x plus 2, power of 3. So, you see here, what, what is happening here is that y, when you dy, <coughs> okay, y, so when you differentiate, you get dy over dx. So, dy over dx, to get back to y, you integrate. So you see here, y, uh, when I differentiate, I get this one. So this is dy over dx, right? So when I when I integrate, I will get back my y. So this is what happening here. So 2fx is equal to 5x plus 2 divided by 2 minus 3x. So here we'll find the differentiation of fx. So you see here differentiation, so we have both equation up and down here, so we have to use uh, quotient rule, right? So, so since we have up and down here, we have to use quotient rule. So quotient rule dy over dx is equal to v du over dx minus u dv over dx divided by v squared. So you have to literally remember this formula. Lah. So here our v, so up here is u, down here is v. So you can see here our du over dx is equal to, so when you uh, differentiate 5x plus 2, you get 5. So right, 5x you get 5, 2 you will get 0. And then below here our v, so below here our v uh, dv over dx is equal to so you see here negative 3 yeah right 2 will become 0 negative 3 x will become negative 3 so you have both now we can substitute dy over dx is equal to so v our v here is 2 minus 3x du over dx is equal to 5 minus our u here is 5x plus 2, our dv over dx is negative 3, so divided with, with v, v square. So our v square is 2 minus 3x square. So here dy over dx is equal to, when you expand 2 times 5, you get 10, negative 3 times 5, you get negative 15x, negative 3x times 5, right? So here is negative, you see here the negative one. So 5x times negative 3, you get negative 15x, negative 15x times negative, you get positive 15x. So 2 times negative 3, you get negative 6, but negative 6 times negative here, you get positive 6 divided with 3, 2 minus 3x square. You see here this one and this one can be cancelled out. Negative 15 and positive 15. So you have 10 plus 6, so you have 16. 2 minus 3x square. So here find the integration of this one. So we know when we integrate dy over dx, we will get y. Right? So the integration of 16 over 2 minus 3x square dx which is equal to, so you will get y, right? But in this in this case, you get fx. So you will get fx. So our fx is equal to 5x plus 2 divided by 2 minus 3x.